can't find nothing. Clean it up. <laughs> So obviously I didn't really throw a stack of lumber at her <laughs> this time. This time, whatever. <laughs> now, <laughs> now that we got some light in here, uh, we can really see how bad it is. Yeah. I mean, we've known for a long time. We're digging for stuff. Things not organized. We've got stuff we never use right up front in the way. Stuff that we always use back in the back. Yeah. Uh, things need to be hung on the wall. I mean, you can see we've, we've done some organization in the past, but it just, it doesn't stick very well once oh. you're in and Over out. Over time it gets... So... Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and probably actually pull just about everything out of here. So this is going to be a chore. It's a good thing we got good weather. Yeah, it's nice. We'll pull everything out. We're going to sort through it. What do we use a lot? What do we not use? What do we never use? What doesn't need to stay here? Yeah, what doesn't? Space. <laughs> let's find a new home for it. So uh, we're going to clean this up. We're going to find better ways to store things. We need to get our poultry fencing up out of the corner we mm -hmm. get it hung up we need to get all the stuff that we hardly ever touch but you know we do use it's one of those things you can't replace right, right. there's no substitute for what it is seasonal we'll get items. yeah seasonal we'll get it put back out of the way and uh let's get this cleaned up and uh make this a little more usable user friendly how about less <laughs> frustrating <laughs> less frustrating so uh we got some light to work with now we got uh got nice weather uh, I guess we got time. We're gonna make time. Make time. We're gonna spend time now so we save time in the future. So let's get after it. That's right over here. We're gonna need a bigger dumpster than that. Yeah, it's only half a half a So we do have a tiller for establishing new ground. I don't think y'all seen us use that. Uh, we're uh, putting in brand new um, garden areas, you know, quick, quick establish, um, tight space, uh, swell building, stuff like that. We need to break the ground, break down into the ground, easier to dig and all that. So we still have that. That's why you've probably never seen that before. Well, we've got uh, everything moved out, uh, a lot cleaned up, starting to move stuff back in, started organizing, uh, kind of shifting things around a little bit, and still trying to find a way to properly hang 
like the poultry netting, things like that, where it's easy to get to, uh, easy to get on and off, and also doesn't get tangled up, uh, doesn't get tangled up in other things. Right. So uh, that's next. Got to get some of the big stuff back in that we don't use near as often. Get it to the back and out of the way, and we'll keep going. Got a bunch of our garden tools cleaned up. Got them organized by what they are. So right here, we get to them a lot. There are cultivating tools, little hose, and everything we use to cultivate the beds, rakes, shovels, short stuff. <laughs> what about the kids, tools? Kids tools, huh? You said short stuff. I said what about the tools? <laughs> what about the tools? Kids tools and just smaller things because they fit there well and we can still put some stuff above it. These are kind of our random, so we've got a pitchfork, we've got a sledgehammer, just things that didn't necessarily fit into the other categories. And hang our little tools up here on a magnetic strip. Which we haven't been through all of this yet. We haven't, we've still got a lot to do. Then we have this big thing. In other parts of the world, a snow shovel, but in Oklahoma, we clean out the shed with it. <laughs> we don't get snow nearly enough to need this. But when we do, when we do, we get it, right? <laughs> All right, so one of the last things we've got left to do, uh, as far as major changes, uh, is we're gonna mount all of the Premier One fencing up here on the wall. See, I've already got the gate hung up there. It's uh, hooks I already had, but I had to go pick up some larger hooks for stuff that we can use here. So I'm gonna attach it here, put the fiber tough poles up here, and then we'll have two sections of netting uh, hanging below and we'll kind of stack those up. So we'll go ahead and do this one first. A little bit of soap on the threads. I'll make it go a little easier. Drag it. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> but it's just enough. fiber tough poles. Now we need to take one of the rolls of fence. We'll hang it up here, hold it up here, and establish how low it can be so we don't have to roll the whole thing up. The netting will still hang below and we'll have it right here and then mount the other one above it and it'll drape over the lower one. So these are just uh, 
these four are ladder hooks. These four are ladder hooks from our local farm store. You know, like a tractor supply, something like that. Ours is Atwoods. But, uh, and then the ones up here are called large storage hooks. That goes up on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Better not. But it works. Maybe go get another one. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so she went to get the other uh, roll of fencing. As you can see, the gate, these are all 48 inch, so 48 inch tall. It's the gate, fiber tough poles. There's, that's a hundred foot netting. And it's the poultry net plus, so it's got more more uh, posts than standard poultry net. And then there'll be another one hanging right there, and it'll just drape down in front of this one. We'll just have to move the wheel hoe. Yeah, just switch. Oh, All right. That's better. So that's better than wadded up in the corner. I've got the solar charger down below it. Find a good spot for that. You see, we made quite a bit of improvement in here. So we uh, still don't have the lumber in here, and I think I did, Aunt. I think so because we. As far as what we're going to bring back what's in. What's coming back in? Yeah, we got rid of quite a bit of things. So it's getting a little dark in here. It's <laughs> past time for dinner, so we had to run to get those hooks and stuff, and we're gonna have some dinner. Probably be done with this for now. I think so. It's a good thing you put these lights in though. Yeah, yeah, we wouldn't be working right now yeah, if we didn't have them. Yeah, it's too dark. <laughs> so. so, those are working good too. Yeah, they are. So, and don't have to worry about killing the battery. Plenty of battery. So, and it's supposed to have some sunny days, so we'll charge back up anyways. So, all right, y'all have a good one. Appreciate it. Uh, Stop by. Be sure and check out our lives on Sunday evenings, and uh, like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And we'll see you next time.